people, 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 people. Kepasa Sakpa say what they do. Welcome to Jamaica Dancehall Source, your source for dancehall and our entertainment and news. Now the first thing that is popping in the news is about an incident that occurred off Spanish Town Road close to the depot of Maxfield, Waltham era, somewhere around there, at about 5.20 in the morning, where it is said that five gunmen or so robbed a bus with some workers that work at a call center. I think the name of the call center is Ibex. Now, people, isn't it kind of ironic that persons going to work or coming from work were robbed by five men that would not get up early in the morning to go to any sorts of job. However, they find the time for rob people at five something in the morning. So people, I am going to let you take a listen, take a look to the accounts of a lady, a victim in that incident, and then I'll give my piece. Hey. I'm just a cover at my see my feel my life at my dead. I say me always say me hear them thing up and them thing about the experience it. So me come out, me think my dead. Me lay down on the ground flat with everybody they on top of me a ball. Who na ball for them mother a ball for them baby. Everybody a ball a big for them life. Me I so the one say the man a tear off the window. Them tear off the door. The driver cause you see first man you know the first man step out on the road with a rifle. When you step on the road with a rifle, the driver said, oh, Where do you see me? The people in ball or I take out first thing I do, I take out my phone out of my bag. Run got the back of the bus, throw it on the back seat, brother. When I throw it on the back seat now, my driver said, I reverse. I said, Driver, reverse, reverse. Everybody a ball ball. The driver said, Yo, brother, the whole the road bad. First thing, the road bad. Say, so, See, by my reverse, you know, I'm wrong him. He should not go far with the first man in see. You should not just go forward when him go reverse at that. We go stuck in at the middle of the road and them come and them beat the driver, them beat him, them beat him. Because them tell him to so open the door for them can come in and like him and say, boss, you know, easy now, you know, easy now. And them start a beating them all gone with the key for the bus. A hot wire police them have a hot wire the bus, so the bus can move out the key then gone with for the bus. Them take out the key out of the bus. Them come in there, me and say, I don't have phone. And then I say, big idiot girl, if you work at Ibex and you're not on a phone, and sitting and them take away the money, take away the boy, them 12, I have 12, a bag of expensive phone, me I tell you. I have three small phones alone, get saved one boy. You have two phones and give them one night and one next girl, she put one in her, she put her phone in her crutches by him reaching her bus car. Too long, them I try to dig up to come in there and them I ease back for the bus and I say, you know, I will shoot up this one, put that way I play, you don't know. What me do, what me do her? So the next one go down hold the driver by his neck and draw him through and let them one draw the draw with the driver and then lean and we are say when you make the driver stay don't go with him don't go with him and we are beg them please make them go with the driver by them I go with the driver the next one climb through the window so comes him reaching at the bus you no know, one him take all the girl and bag you know I be a new worker too you know I want me that once to be a look while me no one say enough of them are new worker kind of girl I say I'm first and my first and my last day, I'm mean, not come back this and that. Some say first and last day. She so, said, Yeah, today I'm first. Then I realized that most of them on the bus, today are them first day at work or something. And when time them come inside of the bus through the window, you now them take that sat and grab phone and I grab up the boy, them take out everybody's money and phone and sit now. And them day they would have gone in a face, you know, your face, so the gun and like one girl a ball for your baby. And him I go so for thump her in her face and I say, Biggie that girl stepping out of mouth now. And when I boy them, I say, Brother, I just a ball, she a ball for your baby, easy. And him start to calm down the girl. I say, no, one and a two and a three minutes, them a rub with. A long time, them did a rub with. Everybody just a drive past. Because about 5.20 to be exact, it happened. Because the bus picked me up. Um, 15 past. And when him drive, I go down, I almost reach. Intersection, uh, 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 we call it a max field. Before we go over and stop like this, uh, this so it up more. And when we look, the boy, them they do a long, them I pop the window, them the door, I mean, they do a chunk of frig. But we say if I push the window, they could not open, they could come in there. Maybe they would have shoot up with. 
Me say, yo, Father God, we home. Me say, everybody chuck pan, everybody pan the ground around at the back, everybody a ball at the worst experience, brother. I beg, can't, we need, me need a home. Me can't come out of my house in the morning, brother. Everywhere a bad place, because them I use one part and I say, well, time this, you yes, so that anything can happen, because they realize, say, once man the rubber and bus and they go through, so every look away, I go try to do the same thing. If ever say the driver shock up, you want to say them beat the driver, because some of them, like them have board gun. They have it wrapped up like board. So when the driver, I took up the driver try to retaliate to them, you know, because they realize, say, two of them out of five must have board gun. So when they realize, say, him see, the next rifle man who have the real rifle, come round, pan him now, and then start butting him and beat him. It's me and yo brother, she didn't even know. Well right now, they are my own to be a car. The reporting business car that now gonna work. You see, by the time we reach cross the stop light, I'll be a police and soldier come and we them a juke down on the bus, you know? Them a juke we don't go and go, come out, pull up on hand, ray, ray, ray. So we have to see man them gone and we them just rob. By them try to go back at the man them. I sit them, I know them not catch nobody. I know them not catch nobody. So when them drive go out to be for a report, I just make my man come and carry me out my yard because I know no reporting now, they don't answer all. Now, people, like I say, don't you find it very strange that a set of men that have no sorts of power, no sorts of strength, to look some sort of manual work, some sort of construction work. However, they can easily pop down the door of people business establishment. Them can easily broke out the window, broke out the door to get to their victims in these buses or in this bus. Can you imagine the scare of these people? 5, 20, 5, 15, early in the morning past Spanish Town Road, Maxfield, wherever it was. It should have been frightening for everybody involved. Five men, one with rifle or two with rifle, and then the next three or so of all sorts of board gun wrapped up. Now people, based on the popo, it is said that they've heard reports or heard incidents of many persons getting robbed coming from these call centers early in the morning, going to work or coming from work. However, a lot of times persons don't report it. So therefore the popo might not put the effort on people. Even if they have one, two or three. The effort is supposed to be there regardless. Because Jamaica is a very scary place. People are get robbed. People are get taken out on a daily basis. Especially volatile areas. Especially when you talk about Spanish Town, Maxfield, Waltham, wherever. Same old same. Now the next thing is that the driver, it seems as if he kind of wanted to defend it. But let me tell you guys something. Anybody that is a driver, whether it is a taxi driver, whether it is a bus driver, working for yourself or working for a private company, do not defend the people in bus. Also, the people in the bus, if you are getting robbed by five men, even if four of them are board gun, one of them is real. Don't try to fight back. Whatever it is that you lose, whether it be a laptop, a phone, cash, ring, jewelry, anything, you can always replace that. It might take a long time, especially if you have a dead end job. However, you can never, you cannot replace your own life. So people, at the end of the day, this just shows you, Jamaica is a very bad place. As an average Joe, average Jane going to work, you get up every day, you work the graveyard, late shift, you go early in the morning or you come home early in the morning and then people want to take what the little change where you have. The minimum wage or minimal pay that you get and then you could lose your life. So therefore, you make the sacrifice. You get up early in the morning. However, people that would not normally get up at 5 in the morning have the strength to get up 5 in the morning to pick up some board or pick up some rifle. Figure rob people. 
And people, you know, say, if the people, if they did not break down the, those doors, those windows, and them get a chance to go in upon the people, or they did not get a chance, sorry, more than likely, they would have blazed up the vehicle because people, we've seen it before. There was an incident a couple of years ago of Elliston Road, wherein a bus was con con up, the driver get con up. I think some passenger also, don't quote me on that. However, people, this has been a very disturbing trend. This is not the first time, the second time, or the third time. Workers coming home from work are going to work early in the morning. Their lives are in jeopardy. And people, this is just an next reminder that, listen, whatever you do, make sure, say, the company that you work for, make you reach back home safe and secure. And then people, then again, what is the company to do? Then provide the vehicle them provide the driver. However, the streets of Jamaica are just not safe for anybody. Whether you are working minimal rate or whether you are working a good wage, it does not make any sorts of difference. Any and everybody in a Jamaica is an equal opportunity target, especially in the wee hours of the morning. So people like me say, the only solution is that the relevant authority get their crime strategy down, the poor poor do the regular beat, Make sure set them up on the road. Make sure that they are present on the road. So therefore, this will kind of deter these criminals, even though you know that they are going to do it because that is their job. Now, people, the next very disturbing thing about this is that when the power point soldier come, instead of them being professional, instead of them being sympathetic, like you hear the lady say, them are bad up the people them. So therefore these persons already went through some sort of traumatic episode and then the poor poor come and they make a bad situation even worse. Tell you about some of the cops. I don't even know what to say. Point blank and period. So anyways people, that is my views on the whole thing as it pertains to that. And like me say, it is just my views and opinion. It is not the gospel. Your views and opinion can be respectfully different from mine. But let me know what you think in the comment section. Bless up.